At the end of May, you can head to the ETSU Mini Dome for the annual Big Train Show. Dr. Fred Alsop with the George L. Carter Railroad Museum is here with more. Thank you so much for being here. It's always a pleasure well, to have you here. Thank you, Ann. It's always fun to come and talk about railroads or birds. <laughs> yeah. So coming up at the end of May, you guys have the Big Train Show. For those that may not be familiar with it, what is it? It's got to be one of the largest train shows in the southeast. It's primarily for model railroaders, but there's something for anybody with a railroad enthusiast in the house. We're inside the mini dome uh, at ETSU. That's 64,000 square feet of space, mm -hmm. and we fill it up. We'll have over 300 tables, and we're looking at about 50 vendors at this point, and they're still coming in. Wow. And so for those that maybe have never been to the big train show before, this is the fourth year you all are hosting mm -hmm. it at the ETSU Mini Dome. And it is just a fun event for the entire family. To come. It is. It's a family event. We've got uh, food vendors uh, in place. We have actual layouts so people can see trains running. Mm -hmm. Jim Milhorn always comes with his live steam, which is a unique kind of thing and that the locomotives and the cars are large. Uh, and uh, they're, they're powered by live stream, not by electricity like most model mm -hmm. railroads. We've got vendors selling anything from books to, to CVDs to, to shirts to all of the, the model railroad equipment that you could ever want to have. They're all going to be there and the prices are good. That is wonderful. And of course you were coming on here today to talk about a train ride, but it filled up like that, it right? Did. The, the earliest we've ever filled, uh, <laughs> we have a train ride going on the 25th of May that uh, will be in Knoxville on the Three Rivers Rambler mm -hmm. with luncheon on a paddle wheel riverboat that afternoon. We do that every spring. So uh, I'm sorry if you missed us, if you missed the boat and the train, but thanks to everyone for filling it up. And we'll do other train excursions this year. Right. You were saying that there's going to be another train ride. So just keep mm -hmm. tuned uh, and you will make sure that people know about that so they can get their hands on tickets if they miss this uh, one, right? Absolutely we will. We, we like to do an extravaganza over Labor Day weekend so uh -huh. that we'll ride several trains over a weekend period. Wow, that sounds yeah. so fun. And so back to the big train train show yeah. happening at the end of May. Uh, tell me a little bit about ticket prices, how people can show up, the hours, all, uh, everything like that. We run on Friday and Saturday. At Friday we open at noon so the last vendors can get everything set mm -hmm. up. And we run till 6, so we're 6 hours. And then we open earlier on Saturday. We open at 10 and run till 4 mm -hmm. so the vendors can leave and go somewhere else uh, early in the afternoon. And it only costs $6 uh, to get in. and. Children under 12 are free, so bring all the little ones because it really is for everybody, right. young and old. Right, and so someone may be coming to the big train show for the first time. Uh, what is it like for you to see their reaction, seeing everything in person? Well, it's amazing to walk into a venue that's wide open, that's as big as a mini dome to begin with, uh, that was created to play football inside. So it's just huge, and then you look, and there are vendors in every direction mm -hmm. with aisles and aisles to walk up and down. This is a place where you see men shopping. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, ladies are sometimes surprised that <laughs> men actually shop, but they'll be going from place to place, and they'll be looking at things, they'll be carrying their shopping bags. It's really a big day for everybody. And again, we've got food available right there in the venue, so you don't have to go any place. And the parking garage just next door is free parking for anyone. It's a covered garage. so. Come on down. Also, the Carter Railroad Museum, that's generally only open on Saturdays mm -hmm. from 10 to 3, is going to be open both days. Oh, wow. And, Wonderful. Uh, we used to get three to 400 people going to the museum as a part of, of the train show as well. Great. Well, it sounds like such a fun Friday and Saturday that you guys have planned for everyone. It's the big train show coming up at the ETSU Mini Dome. All the information right there on your screen. First day is May 31st, second day June 1st at the ETSU Mini Dome. Give that number a call if you have any questions. And coming up after the break, we're heading over to the kitchen with Texas burritos and more. You won't want to miss it. Are you looking for